So there goes the camera. You're famous, you're on YouTube. It's quite placid this one. I don't mean Alex, I mean the wall. <laughs> Good thinking. Morning. What's the day, Alex? Tuesday? Oh, right. Tuesday, yeah. The something something of April. 26th. 26th of April. Short week for us this week. I think we're off to Legoland on Friday. Fingers crossed. Again, another assignment for Shackleton Magazine. But anyway, that's another thing. Today we're on a rescue mission. Um, customers rung us up and said, that I've got a bit of a problem with the wall here. And I came to have a look at this in December and we're back from a &E over Christmas so we're finally here so I'll spin you around and show you what's what so prepare yourself it's not pretty I don't mean Alex I mean the wall <laughs> that was uh, pretty shocking <laughs> as that Welsh guy on Instagram says absolutely shocking So as you can imagine, our job is going to be to save this. To dig the foundation, a few flags on end. The flags are supposed to... I didn't even notice that. What? There's just sat on flags. Yeah. Flags are supposed to be level. That's probably a good three inch fall on them. So we're going to put a footing in, bring our wall up past the flags, so they can bring the flags up. Yeah. This is how it was left, by the way. This is what they did. That's uh, pretty well done. This is how the job was left. This is cement that they were using. Never touched that. No words. I don't know if they did the flags or not. I think the flag, the steps might have been original. They just worked around it. Look at that. That's it. This is this is the finished job. It's not even cut straight that. It should be a uh, how to knot. Yeah. And the um, customer was struggling to get someone to do it. So um, these these are just some random builders off Facebook. So you've got to be careful when you're getting someone to do your work. You need recommendations. You want to see the work. And you want to speak to people who've had them work for them before. I mean, the rest of it's not awful, but it's not good either. Yeah, it's pretty good here. So there you a go. A bit of sand cement just tossed in at the front. And hollow underneath. Try the next one. I'll just pop this down. Oh, got frogs. Frog. <laughs> a little frog there. You better move, pal, before you get squished. Let's get him out of the way. He's going to get squashed. There, we got him. There you go. That's how, uh, that's how deep the holes were. It's enough for frogs to live in. <laughs> well, you go down there, go on. There he goes. Same thing. Yeah. What's it sat on? Sand? Yeah, there's not even any cement under that. Well, the one plus side is... It's easy for us. It's easy for us to take up. Yeah. When it's like this. Yeah. So yeah, the plan is we're going to build this up in a nine inch wall, back skin underneath the flags, front skin to run past with a coping on top. So it'll look like a single wall, but it won't be a single wall. And then these flags are going to be laid back to, to the back of our wall. So in effect, it's going to be there like that coming up. So these, for these back four rows are going to have to be lifted and blended back flat. Um, down here is not so bad, you can see it's been flooding, so obviously that echo drain needs cleaning out. But yeah, we've got to get it, got rid of all this. We're going to, this end here, we're going to follow through, it's going to be grey, Wiresdale. Wires Steps, back along there, and then we're going to skin in front of that. We're not knocking that down, we're going to build in front of it. And then uh, put a coping on top of that. <coughs> so yeah, that's enough waffling. Let's get some work done, hey? He's okay here. 
Yeah. Stack them in on top of each other, but like 45 degrees. Like spin that round so the corners stick out along the square bits. <coughs> They're easy to pick up then and put down. Like this. Like that. Yeah. Stack them like that. Yeah, so there you go. So, as usual, we'll whip you on time lapse for a bit while we get um, organised. And then we'll we'll check back in. Time lapse will be done in two seconds. <laughs> yeah, we'll check back in in a bit. Catch you then. Right, we're back. That, I just forgot to press freaking record again. But obviously that didn't take much to get out. That, that, that I popped off, that I just flipped up the, uh, I just flipped, got the pick under the flag. Look, the flags aren't even laid on sand and cement. They were just laid on the floor. Freaking disgrace. So what we've done now is just set our line up to make sure we're parallel. And that's, um, that's our line to follow now. So what we're going to do is go, go through here now, pop everything else out of the way, move everything out of the way, so we can start digging a little trench through here. So we're going to pile everything here for now, because the skip's not coming till tomorrow, is it? Yeah. So, Alex, we need to get all this shit back where that tun bag is, so we've got room to work. Yeah. Yeah, so by the end of the day, this is going to look a lot different. Yeah. So I'll, um, I'll, I'll film this bit actually, I'll pop and go, go along here, yeah. show you just how bad it is. So, um, where should we put the camera? Uh, put it here? Yeah. Put it on the tool bag. We'll work our way back to the steps. Frog. Have we? Yeah. There he is. He's bigger than that one. Say hello to the camera. You're famous, you're on YouTube. It's quite placid this one. Don't go near the, um, the concrete. Concrete. Yeah. Oh, that's that's a, They're getting smaller. You make that out there. And then you squashed in. 
Ich werde ich werde die Glocke verzapfen, aber. Ich habe gerade das Flach weg. Ich muss schon gut werden. Ja, da Ja, dann noch zwei Bezüge Ja, Because there's a lot of crap behind it. <laughs> well, maybe not. thinking it's nowhere a great wall of China is it no it's not a great wall it's no Thank wall it's not even a wall Ready? And as you saw on that slow mo, it's coming apart pretty easily too. So, Sean, um, and welcome to How Not to Build a Wall with Steve and Alex. Um, featuring the frogs. Featuring the frogs. Here we go. This, that, this come from there, which we just dragged over, obviously. The reason why we dragged it over, this is the end here. There's the bottom block, and there's a crotch section of the foundation it was on. That's it. That's all it was sat on. It's barely the width of the wall. Just a bit of sand and cement straight onto the soil. And everything we've used was reused stuff as well, so it was all full of mortar and just a disgrace. So we're at a position now where we can start digging, pull all that back out of the way, start coming through with our trench. Um, we're going to leave the steps in for now because that's the steps are going back in the same place, so we'll work back to the steps. We'll pull them out and then we'll just put we'll dig a little concrete pad for them. 
Yeah. Let's crack on. Okay. Speeds up.
And there we have it. That is one trench dug. So now we are nipping to, we're we nipping to Fairwoods. I know, yeah. That's all just come from digging a little 200 mil trench. But yeah, so I think, mil. oh, 300 mil. I thought it was 200 deep. No, it's about 100 deep. It's probably, there it's about 200 deep because it's a big pile. Yeah. Trench is done. Yeah, trench is done. So we're going up to Fairwoods. Fairwoods in Apollon to go grab some stone. Ton of ballast. Ton of ballast. And then we're going to get that mixer on. Get this concreted. We're just uh, we're awaiting a call from Hughes Gray to see if the bricks are in stock. Because um, Fairwoods have only got a third of what we need. Fairwoods don't have enough, so we need to find somewhere that's got enough for tomorrow. Because obviously, Greystone's very popular at the moment. Yeah. So fingers crossed that they get back to us with with some good news. And until then, we'll go grab some. Grab some supplies and we'll catch you catch you back here. Right after a quick lunch. So we're getting delivery then, but we haven't ordered anything. Yeah, after a quick lunch, we've cleared the van out. We're gonna get a ton of ballast in there. We're gonna get a seven cement there. And then we're we're off through the house with the stuff. Bit of a pain, but it needs to be done. So I'm off to Fairwoods, which is in the same village where we're working now. So I shouldn't be long getting that. I'll get loaded up and that's going to get set up. Mix is always round there ready. He's filling all the buckets up with water so then we can just spend the next couple of hours blasting the concrete in. So, um, here we go. We shall see you in a bit. Right, it is after lunch and I'm back. <laughs> Dad's just gone to get the stone because we forgot to take the mixer out, of course. So he dropped me off, we've unloaded the mixer, so we've got room for them stone now. And yeah, so I've just been getting everything as prepped as I can. I've got some ramp systems just to uh, get the barrows in and out easy enough. Um, I've tried to move some of this back a bit just so we can get the mixer around and get the concrete dumped in there. I've made a start leveling that up a bit more as well because looking, it's going up a little bit, it's a bit of a hill, so I've just uh, started to carve my way through it and make life a bit easier. Got the laser set up. We picked that up while we uh, swung past home, so this will uh, make things a bit easier getting the levels sorted. Uh, but yeah, that's all I've really been doing to get set up. All I really can do. So I'm gonna start getting some buckets filled with water and then again, just see if any more of that hill needs leveling out. But until then, I'll see you when Dad comes back. There's Alex. Um, t two of those bags have got holes in the bottom two. So maybe push those top two off. Use the bottom two first. Anyway, first bar is through, through the house. This is when, um, this is the only time I'll admit a stand would be handy. This is the only time. And that's simply because we're working back to front here. We've got no skip. So this is waiting to go in the skip tomorrow. Otherwise we'd have all this patio room to work. So we're just gonna mix it, tip it in, and work our way down as best we can. Yeah, sun's blazing now. Alex just checked the um checked it over the laser level, it's within two inches, so we're just gonna come through and level at that. Start off at hundred mil at the top and work our way through. So yeah, we'll stick on time lapse as usual. And um see you in a bit.
And there we have it. An actual foundation door can concrete it. An actual, con an actual foundation. Oh yeah, it is now. Yeah. Bit different what was there, yeah, so you saw what was there, so. What's behind you? Yeah. That's already a, that's already a vast improvement. So obviously if we're gonna let this dry. We still have yet to hear from Hughes Grey, but I think Dad's gonna get in touch with them again. Because we need to find out if we can get these bricks for tomorrow. So that'll be the plan. And yeah, it's been a nice it's been a pretty steady day. Steady day, yeah. Just not, not ideal having to go through the house and not ideal not having to skip because we've yeah. got a lot of work. We've got a couple of hard work tomorrow. Yeah, but you may do with what you've materials got. Tomorrow then. So Thursday morning we're off back to the... Uh, Thursday we're back to uh, extension the, the extension, yeah. And to take the steels off the van. Take the steels off, load them, load them on the wall at least. And then with the leftover stone that we have, we can just dump that in the uh, outer how was your part for black filling? We're not building anything on it because we're away Thursday. We're away, we, we, uh, we set off on that Thursday, so. Right, so there it is. If you liked it, be sure to give it a thumbs up. And if you're new to the channel, be sure to subscribe because that's always a massive help. Uh, we shall see you in the next video. Until then, take care. Hit the like button. Mm -hmm. I've already said that. Did you? Yeah. Oh, no. <laughs> see, see you next time.